So I, right. Uncle Farron's going to tell you about the one time he got invited to a threesome by two lesbians off of Tinder. Okay, so one, I think, Friday or Saturday night, I was sitting at home off work flipping through Tinder when I saw this advertisement, and that's, that's all I can say it was that I saw of two sporty, gorgeous-looking lesbians. And on it, in the little caption, it said, two lesbians looking to uh, invite a male partner to have sex with us. And like any um, <clears throat> young gentleman, I mean, when I saw that, I immediately clicked on it because I'm like, fuck it. And these girls show up, and I start talking to one of them. And after a few minutes of talking to her, she tells me that they're both girls that, like, are in a relationship. And they're pretty much strictly lesbian. One of them, I guess, used to kind of go with guys. And she was a little more girly. And the one I was talking to was the more, um... Uh... All in it from the women. But she was really cute in a fucking Juno kind of way. So I'm talking to her. And after talking to her, she has these weird little um requirements. She's like, first of all, there's no eye contact when, when we're fucking around, when we're having sex. There's no eye contact, no hugging, no kissing, no lovey-dovey shit. And she's like, you gonna have a problem with any of that? I was like, well, I mean, you're the boss. Uh... I kind of like to cuddle myself, but, I mean, if you don't want me to, then I definitely will not do it, man. And she's like, okay, okay, okay. And I'm like, well, what made you choose me? All the men, who you could have picked, to come and hang out with you and your girlfriend. Why don't you pick me? And she said, because you're clean, you're pretty, and you look like you have a high endurance. And she said, I don't get a lot of dick. And I really don't think she'd ever gotten any. And she says, I don't mess around with that shit, but I don't want no man who's going to fucking hit it and knock off and be done. He's like, she's like, I want somebody to be able to go with me and my girlfriend. I want my bang for my buck. Like, the dude better hang. And I guess from the way I look, she thought I could hang. So she's like, so you don't have a problem with any of this? You, you can come by and meet with us? We're at this hotel room. You can come? And I'm like, yes, ma'am, I can. And the only thing, like, I didn't buy any of it through the whole conversation. But the only thing that really stuck with me and made me think when I got there, I might have actually showed up and found two really attractive lesbians that just wanted to get dick, was that she asked how long it would take me to get up there and start fucking with them. And I was like, well, ma'am, you kind of far into, um, you know what I mean, town in Pensacola. I live on the boonies in the outskirts. It's going to take me a good, like, 30, 40 minutes to get there. And the only thing that made me know I was talking to a woman that probably ain't never got no dick in her life was she said, Oh, really? Fuck that. I ain't got time for that shit. <laughs>